We have had the craziest day. Um, it's only lunchtime, and honestly, we've caught so many fish. We've gone to a beautiful island. The weather has absolutely turned it on for us today, uh, being five knots. So let's rewind and see what we got up to. Just getting dropped off on this beautiful island. Josh is just nosing in and I'm going to jump off with Nala. <laughs> lunch break and just to show you <laughs> so yeah we've had um, we've had an amazing morning so far fishing and yeah just too much action to even stop and have breakfast five knots um, predicted so we've just hung around the islands and yeah, it's just been the best morning. And now we're just doing a little explore of this beach that we've been wanting to come to. So yeah, I'm gonna have a swim, we're gonna have lunch. And yeah, I'm not sure what the rest of the day is gonna hold. It's actually easier to just walk barefooted. Lots of bait um, around just off this little island here. I had a couple of casts, but no luck. Um, but we're gonna keep going. I've always wanted to catch uh, an island GT because I have heard from other fishing professionals that they are bigger or stronger or put up more of a fight. So that would really top the day off if we caught an island GT. Same as that other gorgeous beach um, that I've been to before. It's just made up of all of these shells. And then crystal clear water. Right. 
Oh, oh. Yes! That is awesome! Now under the gills. Massive! start to the day oh my gosh I literally as soon as it hit the bottom I thought I got caught and then yeah I was just straight on so oh <laughs> so stoked with that oh my goodness Whew. I just caught this massive nana guy on this snap bait squid, squid jig Whew. measuring at about 80 you reckon I think it's my biggest one pretty sure great start to the day oh that's a good one yep Exactly the same shark that you just caught. Exactly the same one. Oh, what an annoying shark. Damn it. Oh. Alright. Okay. I just caught a shark. Exactly the same one Josh caught like five minutes ago. So, yeah. some spots marked this morning and we've just been uh, drifting over them <sighs> just using squid jigs today and uh, chasing the reds <sighs> you see it yet? No. Oh, how deep is it? 60 meters we think that's a 180 foot. Mm. I really want to get it in the boat quickly. Just in Ooh, what's that? <sighs> Whatever it is. It's uh. Oh. Is it not a good one? What did you see? God, you're probably... Oh, that's annoying. Woo. Okay, well, do you know what the fish have on it? Golden Trevally. I wanted to catch definitely not I honestly thought I was onto a red emperor but golden trevally um, now we don't eat these ones so I'm gonna put it back pretty quickly <laughs> so 
So we were after red fish, but I got this one, and that's the head shakes that I was feeling. This is a Golden Tree Valley. I definitely don't eat these ones, so. Oh! I'm gonna put him back. Oh! Alright, let's put him back. He's got so much energy. Okay. Okay. Oh, it's annoying using your energy on those ones, but still lots of fun. This is turning out to be such a good day. I'm on to my second nanny for the day. I am definitely going to give this one a measure because it looks big, but I don't think it's as big as my first one. So yeah, we basically what we're doing is we had a couple of marks um, set out and we just drift over them, um, drop down and drift over them. So still using the squid jig and yeah, so far, with bait on it as well. Um, yeah, so far it's definitely working out for us. It's been a cracker of a morning. Okay, so we're using these bait rigs. If you wanna check it out, uh, I've got the link below for a discount code. Uh, this is my second Nanagai for the day, measuring at 80 centimeters. So yeah, it's like 10 o'clock in the morning. So a very good start to the day. So let's go catch some more. Wrap for us for today. It's time to head home.